Hey guys, what's up? It's CJ Trades again. And today we're going to finish off the 1992 to 93 Fleer basketball box, as you can see right there. And this is part two of the series, and I'm going to do the rest of these cards. We're going to go over them really quickly. And really quickly, I'm going to go over the cards we got in part one, in case you missed it, and it's on my channel. So we got Kenny Smith. Charles Barkley, Dikembe Mutombo, Manu Bull, Hakeem Olajuwon, Carl Malone, Michael Jordan, James Worthy, Shaquille O'Neal, Michael Jordan again, Shaq again, David Robinson, Alonzo Mourning, Latrell Sprewell, Charles Barkley, Christian Leitner, Charles Barkley, Robert Parrish, Clyde Drexler, Patrick Ewing, Dominique Wilkins, Kevin Johnson, LaFonso Ellis, Dennis Rodman, Scotty Pippen, Spud Webb, and Robert Horry. And if, in case you were wondering, the cards were not sleeved up or anything when I got them. So let me find an example card. Here we go. Michael Jordan. So just in case you're a new card collector, the way I do cards is I put a small penny sleeve on the inside here. And then a thicker case on the outside to keep it protected. And then just in case if you have one, you can put one of these kind of papery, uh, more flimsy stuff on the outside with a seal on the back. Just to protect your cards more. And these cards, the reason these cards are the ones put into the cases is because they're 92-93 FLIR cards. And a lot of them are slam dunk versions, which was a set of the cards and Fleer for the 90s. And if you want to know if your cards are valuable or not, I have a link in the description to Sports Cards Pro, which has, you can find almost any set on there, and you can find a ton of different basketball cards and what their value is. So we're going to start off with the 76ers old uniforms with Percy Hawkins, Jeff Hornacek, Andrew Lang, we're just going to go very quickly through everyone. Danny Ainge. Charles Barkley again. I'm going to put that to the second pile. And this also is where I, I will explain the pile. So this is where I'm just putting any other card of players from the 90s that doesn't have too much value. And then this pile is going to be guys who are valuable cards and valuable players. So on this card... I want to hold it on the side so I don't get the card dirty or damaged. And it's postseason trade, meaning he went from the Sixers to the Suns this year. And Charles Barkley is obviously a legend. So I will sleeve this card up. And you want to be really careful not to damage it by knocking the corners or just bending the card at all. So there's that. And I'm going to put that here. And then later, after the video, I'm going to put that into a thicker case like these. And then a third pile will be if there's any slam dunk cards. Or just other cards I think are really uh, interesting or valuable. Oops. That will go in the third pile. So as we go through the Trailblazers. And then onto the Kings. Mitch Richmond, who's great with the Warriors. Spud Webb again with the Kings. Terry Cummings, Sean Elliott with the Spurs now, Dale Ellis, Vinny Johnson, the Admiral David Robinson I'm going to put here in the second pile. And now with the Supersonics, who are obviously not a team anymore, but now they're the OKC Thunder. And they had pretty good 90s with, I was just going to mention, the Rain Man Sean Kemp, who I'll put in the middle pile. Nate McMillan, who's now the Hawks coach, I believe. And then the Glove, Gary Payton. Number 20. And then onto the Jazz, who also had a great 90s with John Stockton there. Getting dunked on by his own teammate, it looks like. And there's Larry Bird contesting Corbin. Mark Eden, one of the good shot blockers of the 90s. And these, usually you want to sleeve them up, but I'm just going to hold them carefully. And I'll sleeve them up after the video because it takes up a little bit of time. And then still with the Jazz, Jeff Malone, not Carl. And there's Carl Malone. 
Jerry Sloan, who was a great jazz coach, John Stockton, and then on to the Bullets, who are now the Wizards, Rex Chapman, who I think went to Duke, Purvis Ellison, Harvey Grant, Larry Stewart, was unsettled as a coach, who was also a legend in the NBA, David Wingate. Now, NBA League Leaders card. So here's Dennis Rodman. I'm going to assume that's for rebounding. Michael Jordan. I'm going to handle these carefully because I don't really know their value or worth. John Stockton. I'm going to guess passing. Buck Williams. Maybe blocks or... And then... Dana Barros. Looks like a three-point shooter. So I'm going to put these in the third pile only only because it's a league leader's different set and then david robinson probably blocks chris mullen thrown tmc michael jordan again larry johnson looks like i'm unboxing space jam david robinson again detlef shrimp who's also a sonic and then oh wow these are really cool artwork there there's clyde drexler for the blazers that's super interesting Tim Hardaway, Kevin Johnson. I really like the artwork on these. I didn't know they made these. Larry Johnson, Scottie Pippen, Isaiah Thomas with the Bad Boy Pistons, and then NBA Schoolyard Stars. So I don't know what these sets are. I've never heard of them. Starting off with Larry Bird, Larry Johnson, Scotty Pippen, Dennis Rodman, and then here is the checklist you can get. And let me stop these from sliding too much. Try not to damage the cards, really. And then we're going to go through this quickly, but if it's like the cards we just opened, those are all pretty, pretty special cards. And here's another Kenny Smith, who I'm going to shift this pile back. Otis Thorpe with the Rockets. Rudy Tomjanovic, who I think he got punched in the jaw, which made him retire out of the NBA when he was younger. And then the Pacers with Reggie Miller. Detlef Shrimp. Oops. And then Rick Smith's here. Michael Williams. And then to the Clippers. Gary Grant. Ron Harper. Danny Manning, Doc Rivers, now a coach. And then moving on to the Lakers, Vlade Divac, AC Green, Sam Perkins, Randy Fund, Byron Scott, great Laker, Terry Teagle, Sedale Threat, 